Hi guys, I am Moran. Uh, in this video, I will solve a question from Physics uh, 101. Uh, so, uh, we have a cube here with mass m, and um, we have a surface with a small hole in it or on it. Um, we have a rope connected to the uh, cube, and we uh, have, um, we set the system as you can see. And uh, the cube um, makes uh, moves around the uh, hole uh, with velocity one initially, uh, and um, this distance is r one. And uh, the question says that uh, we make r one to r two uh, by pulling this rope from the uh, bottom uh, so R2 is less than R1 now so this is a new um, position for the cube uh, this is R2 now this was R1 the big one was R1 and it has the velocity of V2 um, so what is the initial tension in the rope? Uh, as you remember the formula for the force uh, because of the rotation is f equals to um, m v square over r now um, for the initial case we know that um, the mass is uh, small m times v1 squared divided by r1 this is the answer for the part A. Uh, what's the final tension in the rope? Uh, the final tension is found in the same way. Uh, m times final velocity V2 times uh, V2 squared divided by uh, the final um, distance which is R2. This is the final tension in the rope. Um, so what's the work done when we uh, pull the rope from the bottom? Uh, we need to calculate the um, energies for both final case and initial case. Um, so um, the initial equals to 102m and square of velocity. Uh, e final equals to 1 over 2 m v2 square uh, so work done equals to e final minus e i which is 1 over 2 m v2 square minus v1 square this is the work done uh, by us Thank you for watching.